Hi guys, it's the Sister Lactiva coming straight at you talking about what? Natural hair, of course, and skincare today, ladies. All right, so we're going to talk a little bit about how to keep your skin beautiful, and we're going to talk about how to tie a head wrap. I tried my first one this past week and loved it. All right, so I'm just going to share with you a little bit about what I did. To introduce myself, I am the Sister Lock Diva. I am a natural hair blogger as well as a beauty blogger. I love to talk about natural hair, fashion, and beauty. So I'm just sharing my experiences with these topics. Let's start off with the skincare ladies. So skincare is really important. Number one part of any skincare regimen, you got to drink water, ladies. Now, me, huh, I can tell you I definitely struggle with that, but I am trying to make greater strides in drinking more water. Uh, they say that eight ounces a day, I mean, not eight ounces, eight cups a day, 64 ounces is really what you need to really keep your body functional. Ladies on biotin, also keep in mind that biotin really does require you to drink water. You need at least 32 ounces in your system every day if you're on biotin. If you're not on biotin, it's good for your overall health anyway. So drinking water is the first part to any good skincare regimen. Number two is really getting into a good skincare system. Um, there are a lot of systems out there. Um, two that I'm using right now is I use Philosophies, Your Best Face, or I cleanse my skin with my Mary Kay Miracle Set. And I'm going to talk about the Mary Kay Miracle Set today. It has four steps, and I'm going to show you. Whoops, right here. So let's get to it. All right. Step number one is this step right here. This is the Mary Kay 3-in-1 Cleanser. Um, it's a 3-in-1 cleanser because all in one step, it cleanses, it exfoliates, and it freshens our skin. All in one step. This is really good stuff. Um, I cleanse my skin with this most days. So just doing it just like any other cleanser, making sure you're rinsing it off well, and then you go on to step two. Depending on what time of day it is would depend on what step you're going to be doing. So daytime, whoop, this is what I'm going to use. This is my uh, day solution with the Mary Kay Miracle Set. The day solution does have sunscreen in it. I believe it's SPF 15. Oh no, 35. So really good skincare protection. Skincare protection is really important because as we go out into the environment and come in contact with debris and sunlight and all those things and UV rays, we need to make sure we have a layer of protection over our skin so that we don't get things such as skin cancer and um, have difficulties with our skin texture as we get older. And then at night, my step two is going to be my night solution. Night Solution is awesome. There are all these microbeads in it, if you can see there. And what these microbeads are, are they're full of chock full of vitamins, all kinds of vitamins, but especially vitamin E. Love it. Squirt a little bit out on your hand. As soon as it comes in contact with oxygen or the air, it immediately bursts and you have vitamin infusion going directly onto your skin. Love this stuff. Then your step three is your moisturizer. Any good skincare regimen is going to include moisturizing your skin as the last step. You need to be able to replenish that moisture, especially if you exfoliated that day, which kind of removes the dead skin cells. So I always put on my age fighting moisturizer, which has 11 age fighting benefits. Ladies, we're not getting any younger. If you're in your 30s or older, you definitely need to be using skincare because research says starting as early as age 21, we start to age. Are you serious? 
21. I'm thinking about finger popping, having the time of my life. And your skin is starting to age already at that time. So I suggest you get, get on your age fighting moisturizer, ladies. All right. So that's just the basics on my skincare. So my other piece of my video today, we're doing a head wrap. So why would you wear head wraps anyway? Head wraps definitely can be cultural. In some cultures, like um, the Muslim culture, you do cover your hair as, um, a, as a cultural belief. Um, and that's well and fine for, um, cult for different cultures. But sometimes it isn't about your cultural beliefs. Sometimes it is a way to protect your hair from all the harshness of the wintertime out here or protecting your uh, hair from the sun in the summertime. Two good times to definitely be doing the head wraps. So how I like to do, sorry there, I was picking my scarf up. So this is my scarf. This is a scarf I bought at Target. It's a pretty big one. As you can see, you can't see me anymore. <laughs> now you can. So I like the big ones. This one happens to be satin. Um, so I like to use satin scarves. If you're going to be using a different material, I would suggest strongly that you put a satin scarf under it to be able to protect your hair under it. Okay, ladies? So let's get started. How do we do this? So I'm going to start by putting my big scarf into a triangle like so. And I'm going to kind of bend over here and put it on. And I'm brushing my bangs down on the front because I like mine with bangs. That's just my personal opinion. So, I have my bangs out in front, as you can see. I'm going to take this short piece, and I'm going to tuck it behind the knot. So I tucked behind the knot. I'm going to retighten. And these two longer pieces, what I like to do is twist these together. So I'm twisting, I'm twisting, 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 yay, yay, yay. And I like to twist, not till it's totally to the end, but almost. So, there you see. Not fully to the end, but almost. Don't worry about the white tag. That won't be caught up once I finish twisting the whole thing. So, I just nicely wrap this into a little bun. Feel my white tag. I'm trying to stick it inside so you can't see it. And I'm twisting around and then I'm kind of tucking in under the bun. And there you have it, ladies. So there I have my fully fly head wrap. I have my bangs, like I like to wear mine out, and I have my big funky earrings on. My earrings, as you can see here, these are by Two Light Creations. They were um, a featured vendor at the Four Natural Girls New Hair Resolutions, which was in Wilmington, Delaware. I believe that was last weekend or the weekend before that. So I really enjoyed meeting these ladies and buying some of their nice funky jewelry. So. If you want to make a head wrap, ladies, you should try this. It's really fast, really easy, and it can work. Just buy some cute, colorful pattern, and you are good to go. So, ladies, if you're interested in learning more information, you can always follow the Sister Log Diva on Facebook. I'm on Twitter. I'm on YouTube, obviously on this channel. <laughs> I'm on Instagram. Um, I'm on LinkedIn, so I'm on a lot of different social media platforms. So until next time, ladies, keep your skin as well as that hair absolutely beautiful. 
See you. Bye-bye.